South Sudan's first vice president says his visit to neighboring Sudan aims to consolidate peace between the two countries. Taban Dengai says he has President Salva Kiir's personal commitment to establishing concrete and productive relations with Sudan. Dengai arrived in Khartoum on Sunday. CCTV's Patrick Oyet has more from Juba. Taban Dengai says South Sudan hopes to build diplomatic, economic and political ties with its neighbor in the pursuit of mutual interest. But first, the country needs to consolidate power. South Sudan's first vice president is planning to integrate the opposition army into the government forces by June next year. Dengai maintains that under his leadership, the opposition is making progress in implementing the African Union brokered peace deal. He also says is that South Sudan needs support from other East African countries. The first thing we want to do is to stop armed conflict in the two countries. No more violence in South Sudan or Sudan. Our brothers who are in Sudan and are still fighting should accept peace. We can't say it's only Sudan's problem because the violence will spill over across the border. Last month, President Salva Kiir appointed Taban Dengai as first vice president, replacing Riek Machar, whose whereabout remains unclear. There have been conflicting reports that he is in the Democratic Republic of Congo. South Sudan's opposition remains divided, with some supporting Machar, while others backing Dengai. For now, however, Dengai says he will lobby for regional support for South Sudan while continuing efforts to unite opposition within the country. Patrick Oyet, CCTV, Juba, South Sudan.